Hey, what's up guys? Share Synergy in the vicinity and today we have some brand new news on Marvel Studios' Nova project. As you may have known, Nova was a Marvel character that was supposed to show up in Infinity War but never got to show up. It's a big Marvel character from the comics and you've probably seen Nova in a lot of the Marvel TV shows. We all know who Nova is. Point is, we've all been waiting for Nova to finally show up in the MCU and we finally got some news about Nova, so, but before we get started, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, we are almost at 250 subscribers, and if you're new here, post the channel post notification bell, and with that out of the way, let's get into it. This news comes from the Cosmic Circus, which is a really trusted source, and the article is titled, exclusive, Marvel's Nova to be a special presentation on Disney+. Plus. In March of this year's the trade revealed Marvel Studios officially gave the go-ahead on the heavily rumored debut of Nova. Fans were ecstatic to learn that one of Marvel's most popular cosmic heroes was finally debuting in the MCU. Sabir Prezada is currently working on the project. Prezada's previous work with Marvel Studios includes Moon Knight and Miss Marvel. To date, there are no additional details regarding the project, there's no director publicly assigned as well as no set release dates. Fans don't even know which version of Nova will be the one to take up the title for the MCU. The most popular iterations to take up the mantle are Richard Ryder, the original Nova, and Sam Alexander, the new generation Nova. We offered some insight into what Marvel intended to do with the character by introducing Ryder and Alexander in the project. Still, details about how Marvel would tackle this project have been relatively scarce. Now we have a couple of new tidbits that could clear up the mystery of the man called Nova. One of the first questions fans asked was whether Nova would premiere as a theatrical film or a project on Disney+. Plus. The trades at the time could not confirm either possibility. The consensus was Nova would be more plausible as a Disney Plus premiere instead of a theatrically released film. That I kind of don't agree with, I'm sorry. Um, Nova could definitely work as a movie. Nova's such a big character. Nova has a lot of story that they could genuinely like make a, build a whole movie out of it. I wouldn't be opposed to a Disney Plus movie, but I'm not gonna sit here and act like it wouldn't work as a theatrical release. From what we are being told by trusted sources, it appears that the speculative consensus will pan out. The Nova project will premiere on Disney Plus. Now exactly when can we expect this project to premiere? It could be a while before we get official confirmation on a release date. After all, this is still in the writing phase and what makes it all the more challenging to predict could be due to the format Marvel plans to present it on. Earlier this month, we revealed that Marvel Studios was planning on developing more Marvel Studios special presentations. Following Werewolf by Night, this report discussed the different scenarios in which Marvel planned to utilize the special presentation format. One way was to develop projects that have already been previously announced to be in development on Disney Plus projects, while the other was to introduce new characters to the MCU that don't necessarily have that many or or if any at all, connections to the MCU. The reasoning is that these spin-off projects are better in the long run for both audiences and productions alike. In that report, we mentioned some examples of the projects that could be candidates for the special presentation format. Some examples include the untitled Okoye show, the rumored Ten Ring spin-off that focus on Xiling, or projects that have already been announced like Nova and Wonder Man. We have received information from our trusted source that Nova will be a Marvel Studios special presentation. This presentation will premiere on Disney Plus at an unrevealed date at the time, and while details are scarce regarding the show's plot, predictions can be made regarding the upcoming special. Now, that is really interesting. Um, we have been hearing that Marvel will be changing a lot of their Disney Plus shows to special presentations, and that kind of works better. You know, they did Werewolf by Night, phenomenal, story-wise everything. It, uh, I did not expect it to be as good as it, I knew it was going to be good. I just didn't know how good, and it was good. I think their special formats are working a little better. Uh, maybe if they can be like a little longer, like maybe 10 minutes longer, honestly. Just just go up to an hour, just do these. They're essentially, if they do, if they go up to an hour, it is like a little Disney Plus movie, and that actually works better. They can save on production. Audiences don't feel like there's so much to catch up on because these are just going to be like, like one hour long, not like six to nine hours of footage that you have to sit through to understand one project you can just watch this one hour long little movie and what's interesting is previously announced Disney Plus shows are also about to start getting this treatment like I actually do imagine like the Agatha show that was announced will turn into a special presentation I imagine Wonder Man will turn into a special presentation uh, Nova's turning into a special presentation so it's not like they're small character stories into special presentations like Nova's such a big character and he's getting a special presentation which I'm kind of excited about because now it's like I can probably see them having much better production on Nova they can have probably 
a really fire story. Ah, you know what? It's going to be really cool. I'm excited for the special presentation. I would either want a special presentation for Nova or a full-on theatrical film. But I think right now we're at a point with Marvel where everything's starting to change. People didn't really mess with the whole Phase 4 format. And they're, they've seen it. Now they're starting to change it. The way I'm seeing it is it's that movies are starting to become ensembles. Disney Plus TV shows are starting to become big adventures. And now these special presentations are starting to become origins. That means the Disney Plus shows will never have to go through these origins because then, you know, they got their little own stories in the special presentations. So it'll save a lot of time. And I really like that. And I'm really excited for Nova. Let me know what you guys think because that is all we have for today. If you're excited about Nova, please let me know in the comments. I read all the comments. So like, just say something. And with that being out the way, see you guys next time.